The 48 Hour Film Project is kind of like a mini film festival and basically what it does is encourages filmmakers of all kinds from amateurs to professionals to put together a film in 48 hours from scripting all the way to finished edited product. So roll wise we've got our all our major players, everyone here at the table obviously and then Mike and that's as far as I know that are for sure people. We get assigned a genre, uh, a character name, a line of dialogue that must be in the film and also a prop that has to appear at some point. You don't get to choose? You don't get to choose. Mm -hmm. That's the whole they point. Choose everything it's a competition. For you. That's what it is. Oh. What I was really looking for is testing our skills as a team to see if we could actually pull this off on time and keeping our our standard of quality up. Yep. One of the things that I fucking love about some of the movies is the watches. <laughs> you got me excited. You know what I freaking love about the movies? And I'm just acting. I'm getting ready for my acting. Uh, actually. Forget it. Arkham, no, 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 no. I'm excited anymore. I'm, I'm in suspense now. No, I need I to know. It's, it's turned into a thriller to suspense. Beforehand, is there any genres that you want over any others? Yeah, I want comedy. You want comedy? Because Eric scripting is best in comedy. Sarcastic. What do you want? Yeah, comedy. Comedy? Comedy? Some of them sounded like fun, and some of them sounded like they'd be really hard. So, of course, I was rooting for the ones that I knew we could really excel at. Maybe a, a satire or a black, or the, what is the other one? Dark comedy or black comedy or whatever the Dark comedy? Term is. Dark comedy works as well. We can do dark comedy. Yeah. We're, we're twisted. But I still think that a, a creature film or an animal f film would have been entertaining to try to figure out. It's going to be the biggest test of everything we know about filming. Yeah, not too much. Not too bad. We were doing this uh, project with a friend of mine, and he's actually the one that was, you know, all gung ho and encouraging me to do it too. Right, I'm guessing 95 is our. 826. Wait, what'd they give you? Uh, just yeah. Monster energy drink. Oh my god, where'd you get that? You get yeah. tired. No, you? I'm just gonna go get a bag. Where'd you get the bag? So to begin this crazy 48 hour fiasco that's about to happen, 45 teams in the South Florida region all go to one central location and they need to get their elements that they have to use in their film. We got romantic comedy. What? Romantic comedy. We didn't try yet, did we? No. So let's Get it rolling. The required elements for the Miami 48 hour film project are the character is Cliff or Claire Finley. We give you a male and a female version, pick one. They are a waiter or a waitress. The prop is a musical instrument. And the line of dialogue, how do you do that? We are going to call up teams by your group and start drawing the genres. Comedy, they have film noir, romance, dark comedy. Yeah, and some people get emotional. Musical or western? Scrub rats? Scoop rats! Scoop rats! Where are you? Scoop rats. Sci fi! Oh my god, sci fi. I think usually of space, dinosaurs, aliens. You know, there are worse things. <laughs> Costumes and CGI and all that crap. Apparently, we just got sci-fi. Sci-fi. Dinosaurs. The, the dinosaur will out. Oh my god. <laughs> I think we can have both. Huh? Yeah, you can go a million different directions. Yeah. So no wild card. No, no, we don't need the wild card. So the 48 Hour Film Project provides you with three different elements. They give you a character. In this case, we got Cliff and Claire Finley, and they have to be a waiter or a waitress. We needed to use a prop, which in this case was a musical instrument, and then we also had to include the line of dialogue, how do you do that? No, that's ridiculous. With all the genres handed out to all the different teams, the clock is now ticking. Everyone has 48 hours to make seven minutes of cinematic greatness. What's an instrument that people won't, like, want to find a weird, rare one? I have guitars. Guitars. I'm sure someone has a harmonica. I have a harmonica. I have drumsticks. Uh, I have a them. keyboard. I have a kazoo. I have a keyboard. A kazoo. <laughs> we really have anything we really want to do. We have rigs, green screen effects, sounds. A rocket. I oh, have yeah. lightsabers, just saying. Hey there. Okay, cool. Well, we're on our way back now. Sci-fi. I was not a happy camper. I was like, sci-fi? Really? Oh, sci-fi! <laughs> we'll have fun with it. We can make parody sci-fi or comedy sci-fi. Sci-fi. Sci
Sci-fi. When we started brainstorming, there was many ideas being tossed back and forth. I know the boy here wants to play with effects. Mm -hmm. That's right. So I was thinking the, the one we want to do that we haven't done a long time, we've never done, but we thought about it, is the one that you're coming from space, mm -hmm. like the Google space Earth, Earth, Earth do, right into the house. Yeah. yeah. A light, like a, and it plays whatever note the universe you're in. I like that thing that you were saying of, yeah, like, of the, the good luck, the bad luck thing. And then eventually we just said, you know what? We can't continue to brainstorm. We're we're on crunch time here, and the writers need to get to writing, and the animators need to get to animating, and I needed to get to sleep. <laughs> but if you see a harmonica, what are you gonna want to do? You're gonna want to blow it. It's 8.15 in the morning, and uh, Mike and I were up till about 4, 4.30, writing the script. <laughs> I'm so exhausted. I don't know how people do this 48-hour film festival thing. Time to go to BOA and have a table read. And then shoot schedule, film, edit, and turn this thing in. Once we had the script in place for this thing, uh, we jumped right on to filming it. Now we are headed to the first, um location for the short film and uh, we're gonna start. We are jam-packed as you see. Uh, we're using all the space we can. Alex is telling Dylan about his part. Look guys, we do our own props. <laughs> Eric, would you blow me? S to make a wish. Make a wish. To make a wish. How's that? I like love it. Great hand. The harmonica goes right there. That's cool. I love it. Cast and crew wise, we worked out really well together. Everybody kind of adapted to roles that suited them well based on different roles that we've done here from seminars and all our travels on tour. And it was a long Saturday. We had tw a 12 hour shoot for, I think our finished product was about seven minutes. So almost two hours worth of shooting for every minute that you see in that film. Scene one, take 10 and set. My favorite shot when we were filming this project was the phone conversation because when you see these things on TV and they're going off kind of stilted and cheesy, you know that they're not being played in real time and it's kind of awkward and... Hello. Yes, I hear you. There's no time for response. So Bert, directing this film, had an excellent idea. I think LJ too, our director of photography. We um, did a real time phone conversation with uh, me and the other actor, TJ. Hello. Hi, is this Dr. Espinosa? Yes, yes, this is Dr. Espinosa. How may I help you? So it came off very natural. We're dropping a, we're dropping a cursed monica down mm -hmm. off my balcony. Oh, <laughs> I'm having bloopers. Our what? prop master, he's a master of propping. And <laughs> it ended up working really well in terms of uh, film production. I need to move the brown one all the way to here, and then this up to here. Okay, there we're good there. We're Did good I here. Drop the front? Yeah, let's do it now. Scene five, take seven, and seven. That was perfect. Yeah? Yep. <laughs> We're back in the studio. We have about four more scenes, and then we are gonna set up the videos, uh -huh. and then get them to edit first thing like around six o'clock in the morning. And then 48 hours, that's quite the daunting task. I'm excited. We're all excited. We're yeah. exhausted and excited at the it's same that time. that good exhausted though. You believe that? It's that, it's that, you know, I've done something awesome and awesome. I feel like, um, even, we've accomplished a lot, even though it's not complete. I starred the ones that, when you guys said that's it, we got it, or whatever, but not all of them have stars. If there had a star, there's a star at the end of the name. Gorgeous. Well, right now, it's... 2.55 in the morning, mm -hmm. and we're pretty exhausted. Yeah. And we just finished putting in, inputting all the clips. Mm -hmm. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna sleep for like three and a half hours. Mm -hmm. And the goal is we're gonna wake up at six, six thirty. The latest, and we can work till two. six thirty yeah. in the afternoon, which is and twelve hours. Goal, we should be finished by five. But if it's six thirty, it's fine. And then we go and turn in everything. Yeah. 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 Just making sure all the paperwork is good to go. So we decided to get as much shut eye as possible, which was about, oh, three hours, I think. Congratulations, you've made it. It's colder. You're now a time traveler. And here. And it isn't. Here. <laughs> Very cold. 
You ready? You psych? <laughs> Six o'clock in the morning, back in the studio. What does that mean? We do whatever it takes. Thank God for caffeinated beverages. <laughs> Right now it's 3.35. We've actually been here for what, 10 hours, basically. <laughs> Is that it you said? Well, today. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and today only. Feel that All right, guys, this is official final render before we go turn it in. How do you guys feel? I feel accomplished. So I feel proud. Happy. Are you guys tired? Exhausted. You haven't slept yes. at all. We're tired about six of hours in the last two nights. Yeah. Nine in the last three. Well, we've two. been in this room right here for the past 12 hours. Oh, we love it. Room. flew. How it's much fast. longer to render? 12, uh, five, five minutes. minutes. Five minutes. It took us 12 hours to film and 12 hours to edit. Yeah. Writing took you how many hours? Started at 10, ended at 4.30. So that's what, six and a half. And then it took you guys the animations? About the same time. Yeah. About the same time. So, was that another so like a 30 hour together? project? Yeah. So really that's cool. 36 working hours in the 48 hour project. And as that included team. props as and acting and takes and location and transportation. We didn't. Yeah, we were clean. No, we did everything within three to four takes on yeah. everything. Yeah, we were clean. Yeah. We all ended up putting so much of our heart and soul in it that seeing the end product and seeing that it was so much better than I expected it to be, it was awesome. I was so proud of the whole team and so excited that they finished on time and it was just awesome. That's all we can show you for now. Oh my God, dude. Dude, we did it. Dude, we did it. It's due before 7.30, so we gotta get over there. How far is it? 38 minutes was the last estimate. Ouch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And we've got a torrential rainstorm go through in here. Yeah, there might be some traffic today too. So we gotta book it safely. Yeah, there are trees on the floor. That's how crazy this is. 0.8 miles away from our destination, which will be arrived at in approximately that will cut me off in two minutes. Two minutes, even on a crappy day, guys. On a day. Oh my god, I'm so excited, so tired. I don't know if I'm asleep or not. I, I don't know how I feel. I feel like I'm very, it's an out of body experience. Now, what would you wish? I'm past exhausted. Yeah, no, this is the point of. Woo! I feel like we will now hibernate. And we are here at the news lounge, turning our project in. Oh, and what's right. your team think? Uh, Screwbrots and Bowl Studios? Or Group D? Group D, okay. That's very helpful. <laughs> cool. Hey, thought I can help. <laughs> okay. And the title? Uh, it's instrumental. And the mental you? part is capitalized. I mean, hey. <laughs> is this your first in 48? Yes, yeah, that's what I said. Mm -hmm. So have a lot of teams showed up yet? Uh, five? Five only? So far, really? wow. wow! Expecting people to be a little early, but yeah, I, I was like, the I thought we were, ones. I thought we were on the late side. Yeah. Turns out we are kind of not early, but kind of uh, on timeish. We got the thing delivered in time, which is the most important part of the schedule. Get that film in at the 48-hour mark. We were exhausted. Isaiah just showed up. May I help you? Hi, I'm Cliff Finley from Finley's Pizza Planet. Hi, I'm Cliff Finley. <laughs> Dude, what's up, man? How you came doing? by this morning. You came by this morning? Yeah. You did? When? 9.20. 9.20? Yeah. All of us were in deep sleep. <laughs> Dude, are you ready to see the movie? Yes. Thanks. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, that is exactly what I wish for. How do you like it? I like it for the win. <laughs> you think? Yeah. Excellent use of props. Excellent use of props, yeah. I think. Uh, I don't know if anybody baked it in that well. We'll see. Everyone loves your part. <laughs> yeah, your part's awesome, man. You know, we're finishing the project, actually. We're at, we're doing all the, what, the trailers? The poster, the movie poster? Movie social poster. media. Oh, yeah. Wait, what's the poster? Hey, hey, they can ask, they can watch, they can come to bowlstudios.com. <laughs> we're doing the movie poster, we're doing the social media uh, campaign to promote, and we're doing the trailers. That's and the website. A week after the 48 hour weekend, they have a uh, screening for all the films, that at least all the films that got turned in. We're on the way to premiere. 
You excited, OJ? Oh my god, extremely excited. Oh look, she's hiding. Who's that? Hi! Hey! Oh, time to go. Time to look at this. Make it happen. <laughs> We're gonna have to get some popcorn. I want popcorn. It's a real movie, man. We are premiere. We are at the Little Haiti Cultural Center for our screening. A lot of people that are way more dressed up than us. No, that's okay. We're sexy too. On the day of the screening, we were anxious and we were nervous and we were going through like a, a bunch of different emotions. She got it. She got it. Luckily, we got front row. It was really cool. We had a total of um, 45 films. 34 uh, came in on time, so there are 34 in competition. I was watching the different talents that were there and some things I was very impressed with and some other things I was like glad that we had our talents. proud of ourselves at the end. So. We had a real good time creating this film. We truly enjoyed it. Congratulations on another very successful 48 hour film project. My name is Bert Oliva and we're with the instrumental. You guys saw the movie? This is our first time ever in the 48 hour film festival and it was really great time, the, the, even though the pressure was on, it was really amazing, the ideas and everything, how everything came together. So make sure to vote for instrumental. <laughs> and uh, I just want to thank you guys. Easily the best one up here. <laughs> yeah. They like the effect, LJ. You like from the earth. I thought you guys had an actual spaceship for that. It was like uh, people like the movie. I was like, yeah, I think so. I just got stage fright. I'm not the director. No, that wasn't even part of it. That's why I mentioned the director. That happens to me. We did it, man. We did it. Woo, we did it. We literally just like, appreciate it. Yeah, we really appreciate it. Keep it in Miami. <laughs> so now we're going to get ready for tomorrow's event. So, see, that's different. Tomorrow's event is when. It's my state. Yeah, we gotta go home and work. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed watching it. You got to see the behind the scenes. And guess what? Right now, you're about to see the trailer. When an object of unexplained powers comes into your possession, there are worse things. What should you think? <gasps> Who would you call for help? There is somebody. And what would you do? So what you're telling me is that this instrument is stalking you? You don't believe me, do you? Instra-mental.